Hemodialysis Nursing Care Plan Nursing Assessment Correct identification of the patient Note of body weight before and after hemodialysis Observe SSI, fistula, neckline or graft Determine amount of fluid to be removing Monitor and record vital signs Assess the signs and symptoms of renal failure Swelling, skin condition, appetite, dyspnea, fatigue, SOV, change in urination, conscious level and dizziness Assess laboratory values Creatinine level, hemoglobin level, hematocrit level, potassium level Assess psychological level and knowledge level. Diagnosis 1. Excess fluid volume related to decrease glomerular filtration or decrease urine output. This will decrease cardiac output related to increase vascular resistance. This for impaired tissue perfusion related to insufficient hemoglobin and hemocrit. This for injury related to blood clotting and mineral density. This for infection related to invasive procedure. Deficit fluid volume related to disease condition. Diagnosis 1. Excess fluid volume related to decreased glomerular filtration or decreased urine output. Goal to maintain normal fluid balance. Planning multivital signs. What are signs and symptoms of hypovolemia? Administer diuretic as prescribed. Hemodialysis. Check weight before and after hemodialysis. Implementation. Monitored vital signs. Monitored signs and symptoms of hypovolemia. Administer diuretic as prescribed. Hemodialysis done. Check that weight before and after hemodialysis. Evaluation Body temperature, blood pressure, respiratory rate, pulse rate. Remove 3 liter of excess flowing during 4 hours. This will decrease cardiac output related to increase vascular resistance. All. To maintain adequate cardiac output. Planning, Monta vital signs, administer oxygen as prescribed. Advise patient to follow dietary restriction of sodium, cholesterol and fat as indicated. Try antihypertensive drugs as prescribed. Implementation, monitored vital signs, administered Oxygen as prescribed. Advise patient to follow dietary restriction of sodium, cholesterol, and fat as indicated. Administered anti antihypertensive drugs as prescribed. Elevation, body temperature, blood pressure, respiratory rate. Straight. BP level decrease some extended after 30 minutes. Nursing diagnosis 3. Risk for impaired tissue perfusion related to insufficient hemoglobin and hemocrit. Call to improve tissue perfusion. Planning. Assess the changes in skin color and turgor. Administer medication as prescribed. 
wanted capital refill time. Advice patient to take food rich iron and vitamins. Implementation Assist the changes skin color and tiger. Administered medication as prescribed. Wanted capillary refill time. Advised patient to take food rich in iron and vitamins. Elevation capillary refill time. Skin color to be elevated next week. Nursing diagnosis number four. Physical injury related to blood clotting and mineral density. All to prevent injury. Planning. Multi AV fistula patency as frequent interval. Administer medication as prescribed. Advise patient and family members about sources of calcium and vitamin D. Revalues. Implementation. Monitored AV fistula patency as frequent interval. Administered medication as prescribed. Advised patient to end family members about sources of calcium and vitamin D ordinary values. Elevation serum calcium level. No any signs of blood clotting but missing diagnosis number five. Is for infection related to invasive procedure. Call to prevent infection. Planning. Maintain aseptic techniques. Assess and monitor and record vital signs. Monitor antibiotic as prescribed. Monitor and report any signs and symptoms of infection. Monitor WBC count. Implementation. Maintain aseptic techniques assessed, monitored and recorded vital signs administered antibiotic as prescribed monitored and reported any signs of infection monitored WBC count evaluation temperature Blood pressure, respirator rate, pulse rate, and WBC count. No any signs of infection, but patient has risk for infection. Today our hemodialysis sample gap and discussion is over. Give your ideas about our channel. Please note that at the main area.